Hi my loves and welcome to my channel. My name is Erica. This is Gypsy Cowgirl Tarot. I am a psychic medium, oracle, and prophetess. This is going to be just a very, very quick message. Um, I might start doing these like little readings, like five minute readings, three five minute readings. Um, the, the message here is um, that there is great stability entering your life, okay? Um, it's like four wands, ten of pentacles all day every day. Um, this is in career, finances, um, your, your money is going to start stabilizing more, um, and love. There's some kind of very loving partner here. So let's just tap in. Let's just see what's up and, um, we'll go from there. Judgment. Okay. So, uh, the resurrection of something, but you're going to feel like six of wands just flew out in my lap. It's, it's, it's a victory. It is your time of recognition and reward. Um, this is Archangel Gabriel. Okay. Um, with his trumpet, you have been heeding the call, um, of your soul. You've been aligning, you've been healing. Um, this for me is someone also that wants a victory here with you. There's victorious love here. I can feel it. Wheel of Fortune's on the bottom of the deck as I look down. Five of Swords and Ten of Wands. Okay, so this is someone who's um, had some really big spiritual enlightenment. It's like seeing the air of their ways. They're looking back, reflecting back, and they're you know, it's, it's needing to balance the justice scales is what this is. It's someone who wants victory, but this is also, um, about you guys where you guys, yeah, as I stop shuffling, the six of cups shows up nostalgia, someone missing you. Um, and then the lovers. Yeah. Yeah. Someone looking back on the past. Okay. It's like they're judging themselves. It's like they're, they're placing judgment on themselves. Like they're making judgment calls in their lives. Their, their, their judgment is coming down, but it's like they are the judge. They are the one that's been judging themselves. And now they want to, I'm getting order in the court, order in the court. So this could be um, like a judge, but this could be, you know, obviously someone, there could be uh, something that has to do with, with, you know, a courtroom or the law. Maybe someone had, you know, um, a divorce or, um, some kind of like, you know, I'm getting like custody child stuff. Um, but it's, it's about the justice scales. Okay. It's about balancing things out. You have the six of cups, the lovers, um, <laughs> I'm just gonna cover this up. Okay. Um, because of the nudity here, but, um, and then the card that I asked, you know, I just picked up off the deck right here is the albatross, a good omen, monogamy, stamina, and calm. Okay. So Archangel Raphael, this is very angelic, a lot of angelic support, a lot of angelic guidance, a lot of angelic protection. Queen of Pentacles came out also. So you have the lovers, the six of cups, Queen of Pentacles. This is someone, again, I, I got... The message was about you're receiving great stability in like all areas of your life. And the queen of pentacles confirms that. Okay. The devil is also showing up on the bottom of the deck. Okay. So we have, um, I'm just getting that someone wants you really, really, really bad. Like this is like, they, they, they have kept an eye on you or they watch you or they have an eye on you. Um, you know, and in some cases, this could definitely be someone new. Um, yeah, you see the devil, the hierophant, ten of cups. See, this is the happily ever after. Okay, and then the sun card. Yeah, this is you're about to things are gonna you're you're about to start seeing things and things are gonna be revealed to you. This is really beautiful energy though with the great stability. It's like I'm getting that. Can't nobody hold me down. Oh no. So basically what this is, is like, you made judgment calls on your own. You have in one way or the next shown, it's like you, you, you pass karmic tests. You, you, you 
you know, you've healed karma. You had to, like the universe had to see that you were completely solid, stable, and good on your own. That was a part of, you know, generational curses, um, you know, codependency in marriages and love. And, you know, what I'm getting specifically is like, you know, um, like generations back, like there's a lot of like the wife or the woman being fully codependent on a man or masculine with finances. It's like a stay at home mom. There's nothing, absolutely nothing wrong with that. Right. That's, it's beautiful, but it's, it's something where there's been a lot of unhappiness, a lot of, I feel like a prisoner. I feel stuck. So you've broken these chains for yourself in this lifetime and also for your lineage going back and then forward energy. Okay. So, um, there could be children here involved. There could be something about like a spouse, you know, I'm, <laughs> I'm getting like baby mama drama or a baby mama. Um, this could be someone that just has, you know, children with someone or I don't know, but this is you, my loves. You guys are definitely receiving this massive ace of pentacle energy. Um, her divine counterpart is the king of pentacles. So, you know, that's what I'm, that's what I'm getting. So this is a very, very, uh, stable energy coming in and around you at this time. I'm also getting, um, just be patient. Okay. You've been patient. It's another thing you've proven. You've, you've shown extreme growth. You've healed karma. You've been healing yourself and you've been very patient. All right. So let's get one more before I end this overall energy incoming, please. And outcome energy page of swords. Oh, there he is. There's her counterpart. See, someone who has not taken their eyes off of you a king of pentacles this is your one true love in that sense this is your divine counterpart you have the lovers and six of cups someone is very nostalgic they're missing you and they um what i'm getting is they want to have another chance with you they want to resurrect whatever was between you guys and i do feel that for many of you guys who are going to see this that this this didn't really go far like it doesn't feel like you guys were in a serious commitment or a relationship with the page energy. It's like a younger energy. Um, it's just, there was some kind of start and then finish. Okay. So take that how it resonates for you. Um, but this is what I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I know I went a little bit over, but that's okay. So anyways, mwah, love you.